I feel from the moment that you start wrestling, you always feel that you should be farther along than you are, and you always compare yourself to somebody else's success. You always think that either you should be right along there with them or you should be farther in your own career, and I think a lot of times people get in their own head. And I definitely know that that happened to me a lot, and it's every now and then it's hard to take a step back and look at things from a different perspective. But with Jared Genham, he allows you to take a look back to see what is the best thing for you and makes you realize that what you're doing, the path that you're on, and what exactly it is, is it for your individual happiness? What is it that you look for as far as fulfillment in wrestling? And with that different perspective, things have changed so much in this past two, three months for me. I went from, at the beginning of 2017, to losing a bunch of my regular bookings and kind of wondering where I was gonna go next. And I tried the same exact routine that I did before to no avail. But with Jared's help, I was able to try and make myself stand out a little bit and look for things as the way as like, if wrestling was in the real world and how I would handle things in relation to different aspects of my everyday life. And what ended up happening is I got my first tryout and extra work with WWE. I ended up picking up a full schedule, reoccurring bookings, more money, all these things because I was confident in knowing what I wanted. I also revisited my own roots and knew that where I stood out in my benefits, I went to those and I played them up as my strengths where I looked at originally me being into comedy, me being a comedy wrestler, we tweaked it, we went back and we looked at it more as having fun and having myself stand out. And ever since then, I've gotten compliments on my matches. Uh, people have always come up to me and said that I stood out at the show, that my character was the best, that my match was the best. And also, I took the same advice and I applied it to my everyday life. I was sitting in a town where I was perfectly comfortable, perfectly complacent, and all that. And I thought I could have more, and if an opportunity arose, I could take it. And as Jared knows, one of my dreams was to always end up on a lake, living on a lake. And now, as a result, past, in the past month, I've been able to have that. I now have my own place on a lake. And due to it is because not only my personal success and happiness and my willing to go out there and do it, but my success in wrestling. And this has all come full circle. This has all been very beneficial to me as far as my career and also my state of mind. And so with Jared's help, it has made it so much easier to find what I want out of this and stopped comparing myself to others and stopped having to like look, through my, look at myself through somebody else's eyes. And when I started to realize that, it was like a weight was off my shoulders and I sat back and one of the most important things that Jared has taught me is remember to enjoy the moment. And with those things, I'm finding way more fulfillment and way more success, not only in wrestling, but in my everyday life.